Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will talk about a very beautiful plant called cornflower, also known as bachelor's button. This is a seasonal or annual flowering plant that we grow here in our winter spring season. This flower has a very unusual structure, which is very attractive, and they come in really unique colors. I have this beautiful blue color. It is quite rare to have a color like this in the garden. This plant really stands out. One of the reasons I love this plant is because they are great for attracting wildlife. The bees and butterflies just love this plant. They constantly hover over them all the time. These are really easy to grow plants. They don't need too much maintenance and they can grow around 4 feet tall. They have a bluish green colored foliage which looks really beautiful. The flower buds are also quite interesting. They are scaly, almost like zinnia buds. You can plant them with the poppies and cosmos, they look really good together. These plants are sun loving plants, so you should plant them in a sunny area to have better flowers. You can give them partial shade when the temperature is high. Otherwise, give them 6 hours of direct sunlight for better flowering. You can grow this from seed very easily. I grow them from seed every year. This is how they look like when they are very young. You can take a 10 inch container and plant around 3 to 4 plants together like I did. They look good when they grow in buns. The potting mix for this plant is very simple. They don't need too much. Just take a good quality well draining soil. Mix around 20 to 30 percent compost. You can also mix a tablespoon of neem cake powder and bone meal and that will be enough. They are like wild plants so they don't need too much fertilizing. Just give them weekly organic liquid fertilizer. Add 1 tablespoon of bone meal after 1 month and they will do just fine. When watering, be careful. Don't overwater them too much. That can cause fungus problems and root rot. Keep the soil moist and water them when necessary. They can get some pest problems and fungus attack. So apply any organic pesticide and fungicide weekly to keep them healthy. One of the most important step to have great flowering is pruning. Regularly prune them and remove the dead flowers. This will keep your plant alive for a long time and they will flower a lot. You can save some of them to collect seeds for the next season. This is a pretty simple plant with very beautiful flowers. I hope you will enjoy growing them. If you enjoyed my video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to my channel for more content. I will see you next time. Bye!